So let me... Uh, well, in the meanwhile, I, I was thinking about the first project, about this uh, spring project, and uh, I really think there are many possibilities to, to do something about it, and to make different people do different things uh, along the same lines. So, uh, so I, I like this project, uh, and the more I think about it, the more I like it. Uh, I mean, the more connection I see to calculus and the more essential things I find in that project. And uh, I wanted to tell you the discovery I made for myself uh, a couple of years ago, a couple of days ago. Uh, as I kept thinking about the problem, uh, I talked about this this Wednesday, right? uh, about the project. So when we were talking about that project, the design of the spring formalized uh, to the point of having a function. I don't remember all the notations I used. Uh, the function from three variables to two variables. Did I call it f? Or it doesn't matter. So, yeah, you do. so there was this function. Basically you start with diameter of the wire, the diameter of the coil, and the the length of the wire, free length, and it gives you as the output the safety factor and no buckling, avoid buckling, two other parameters. And then what you want is you want to find three numbers to feed this function on the input so that the output satisfies some restrictions. And we looked at those restrictions geometrically, so we looked at the play coordinate plane, and I don't remember, was it, was it safety factor, avoid buckling, or the other way around? It was avoid buckling was on the x-axis. Avoid, avoid buckling and safety factor, and then, so what was it? Uh, avoid buckling should be less than some number, right, less than 4, it's supposed to be greater than 0 at any way, uh, safety factor should be at least 2, right, so basically we found out a region in that plane and as long as we land anywhere in this region we are happy, right, so whenever we find three numbers so that the value at those three is a point there, we are fine. Now, of course, it may happen that you choose these random uh, these numbers randomly and you land there. That's a possibility, right? But uh, in reality, you choose three numbers randomly and you land far from there. Right? So you land somewhere, and then. So you chose uh, numbers, say, D1, capital D1, and L1. This is your first try. And the value f of that triple is somewhere in that plane. And then how to improve that result? How to choose three numbers better? So that is a question that calculus can help resolving. And the idea is that you basically have to move this point closer to this region, and hopefully inside the region. And then I thought about this problem, about this situation. Uh, and I would like to tell you the way I thought about it and came up with a solution. Uh, because that is really a way to think about multivariable calculus as long as you know single variable calculus. 